If you're house hunting, chances are you've come across some real gems on sites like Zillow. I've seen a lot of comments talking about how fun it would be for Zillow to have a comment section, if not to talk about important details, then to make fun of horribly flipped houses together. So I made this, a Chrome extension that adds a comment section to any Zillow listing. I matched it to the style of the rest of the site so it blends in pretty seamlessly. You can comment on any listing as well as see all the comments that you've made in a central dashboard. The entire project consists of two parts. There's a Chrome extension, which adds the comment box to every Zillow listing page. And then there's the API, which stores and manages the comments in a central location so they can be viewed by anybody else using the extension. I'll show you how I made it, some quirks along the way, and provide you the source code if you want to run this yourself or customize it to your liking. Let's dive into it. A basic Chrome extension needs just a single file to start with, manifest.json. This lays out all of the structure and dependencies for the extension to work as intended. Some of these are pretty self-explanatory, like name, version, and description. Permissions determines what internal methods and helper functions that we can use from Chrome to support the functionality of our extension. And it can get pretty specific. There's a whole list on the Chrome documentation site. For our case, we need access to the current active tab, and we'll also be using storage later on for authentication. Content scripts is a list that maps out scripts or style sheets that can be injected into sites that match a particular pattern. And we can define that pattern with host permissions. So for our extension, we're just using this on Zillow.com. So that's the only URL we'll need here. So now we should be able to load up a Zillow.com listing, inspect the website, and see our injected content.js and styles.css files inside the source code. And there it is. See? Hello, Zillow. Now, when a listing page loads up, I want to show a comment box, a submit button, and a list of the previous comments for that listing. These comments have to come from somewhere outside of our extension or browser, a central repository, and that's what I'll be building the API for. Okay, there's our box, our button, and an area for comments, but nothing's hooked up to an API yet. Now, I'm using Laravel for this, which might be a bit of an overkill given the scope, but it's really easy to spin something up like this, especially given the fact that I want user authentication baked in. Now I just need a single model comment to store everything in. A user ID, Zillow ID, and the comment body text. I've got a route and controller added to pull in comments whenever we visit slash API slash comments. Right now there's nothing, so I've added some seeding too so we can have our API pre-populated with some example comments. Refreshing the page, and now we see something showing up. I notice a problem right away though. If you navigate off of this listing and go to another one, the box just doesn't show up. That's because Zillow is an SPA, a single page application, and the new listings aren't full page loads, which would cause the extension to re-render. No worries, we can add in some code to check for a change in the URL, and make sure we're refreshing the comment box whenever that happens. Now, we need some way of authenticating a user. I don't want to have comments just left anonymously. There's a few different ways that we can handle this, ranging from simple and a little hacky, all the way up to the proper way, which would probably be a full OAuth implementation. I'm going to lean toward the former for this. We'll just give the user an authentication token and have them paste it to log in. That's where our storage permission comes in handy from earlier. Now I've added in another route and controller to make sure those comments are being saved and associated with that authenticated user. So if we comment on a listing, boom, we see our addition with our username added under it. I've also added a list of all of the comments a user has made to the API dashboard screen. And that's all there is to it. A comment section on every Zillow listing with user authentication built using a Chrome extension and a simple API. From here, you could expand its use and have it available on other platforms. It's actually pretty easy. We can keep the same core scripts and just add different host permissions for the different real estate sites. We can even modify the style sheet so that the same extension blends into each particular platform. So what do you think? I was trying to think of other things to add to an extension like this. So if you have any ideas, let me know in the comments below. If you want to check out the full source code for the extension and the API, it's linked in the pinned comment below on my GitHub.